expect the first Americans receiving the vaccine early next week. This is the moment the state and hospitals have been preparing for for months. All eyes tonight on the Pfizer plant in Portage in West Michigan. There's no activity there right now, but we expect that to change very soon with Pfizer saying it can ship nearly 3 million doses right away across the United States, most coming from that Portage plant and its plant in Wisconsin. Michigan will initially receive 84,000 doses in a four step phase in plan. Our Mar McDonald is live outside Troy Beaumont Hospital, one of the locations where this vaccine vaccine will be sent uh, in Mara. It's because of the hospital's ability to store it in these uh, special freezers. That deep freeze, Kimberly, that's right. And we expect those trucks to roll out of the Portage Pfizer plant within hours. That's what we're talking about here. This vaccine rollout, it starts right now. And it is reasonable to think that those who are in the first wave to get that vaccine should start getting it by probably Wednesday of next week. Let me show you. These still pics shot by Beaumont today. This is the vaccine supply kit, not the actual vaccine itself, but the liquid it's mixed with when it arrives. And here is how this is going to work. It's run through Operation Warp Speed and the U.S. military. The vaccine will be shipped via FedEx and UPS. The two carriers are splitting the country in half. Here in Michigan, it will be UPS that rolls out of Pfizer's Portage Cold Farm with those precious vials, 85,000 of which are slated for us here in Michigan immediately. I'm very excited about uh, the vaccine distribution. Uh, it means that the end of the pandemic is near, um, and we are working diligently with partners across the state to distribute the COVID vaccines. In what the state is calling phase one, healthcare professionals and those who are in long-term care will get the vaccine first. The healthcare workers uh, who are involved in aerosol generating procedures are the highest at risk to develop the coronavirus. So these will be some of the healthcare workers who are on top of our priority list. Phase 1B, some workers in essential and critical industries. Phase 1C, people who are high risk for COVID and people 65 and older. After that, it's on to phase two, which is mass vaccination for all adults. Back here live, remember Moderna's vaccine is still a few weeks out. When that comes online, it is going to up our vaccine capacity here in this state uh, considerably simply because Moderna's vaccine does not require those special freezers that Pfizer's does. Kimberly Karen, Back to you. Barra, do we know how many vials of Moderna's vaccine will be available here in Michigan after it gets approval? So what we're hearing, Kimberly, is the expectation is in Michigan alone, 173,000 vials. You know, once that approval is given and, you know, more to come. So here we yeah. go. We'll be Back watching it closely. Okay, Mara, thank you.